Hey dolls! So today I have an AMI Clubwear haul for you guys. I have been doing AMI Clubwear hauls on my channel since the dawn of time and that is because I love them so much and they always have awesome, super awesome sales and deals and you can get so much of this stuff for like 50% off sometimes and it's just really awesome. Okay, so the first item, we're just going to jump right on into this video, is this adorable, like, floppy hat for summertime. I just hit myself with it. It is pink, white, and blue. Now, this is the only negative experience I think I've ever had with AMI Clubwear. I've purchased stuff from them before. They've sent me things to review before or to unbox before, and this is the only item that I've ever personally had a problem with and when I got it you can see right here it's starting to do it again but when I got it it was starting to kind of like uh, detach for some reason like the little string that is used in here is kind of like thin and just really flimsy so it kind of just like started it peeling off or like separating and like this whole brim was like peeled away from itself and then there were a couple spots up here too. Uh, it was really easy to fix. I just took a glue gun to it and just kind of like did a thin line and then pressed it down, let it dry, and it did pretty well. But I feel like over time, obviously the more, it, the more it's worn and used and you know played around with and stuff, it will start to kind of do that little peel off thing again. It looks adorable on. I love the colors of it. I was so excited when I saw this on the site because I've been wanting like a big floppy hat for summer for some time and that's why I went ahead and picked this one. But like I said, it kind of sucks because it did come with the little pieces all separated, but it's not junk. Like I didn't just throw it in the garbage or anything. I did fix it and I'm going to fix that little piece that was starting to peel up again. And like I said, it's pretty much good as new, uh, but the fact of the matter is it shouldn't have come separated or broken like that anyway. But regardless, it's still cute. So I put in the effort to fix it and I like it still, but yeah kind of sucked but moving on to the good stuff <laughs> so the first pair of shoes are these awesome wedges they are just kind of this dark fuchsia color with a couple strappy straps and I love these in particular because you can kind of buckle them to whatever size you need them to be and there's a zipper in the back for a quick pull on, pull, pull off, slip on, slip off. Easy to take your shoe off if you need to in a quick amount of time. These feel so nice. They're like kind of like a suede material. So they're, they, they have kind of like a cool feel to them. I really like these a lot. And then the next pair are da, 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 these oh my gosh these okay so these are so so pretty and these are a little bit big on me but what I will do is take my Dr. Scholl inserts and put them in them so they don't like move around as much so da, 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 look at how cute these are they are neon hot pink little wedges with the pointed toe and this beautiful like brassy kind of metal detail right here as like a cuff around your ankle again they have the zipper on the back so you just slip them on and off they're so easy to put on and take off and they just look like so and they're hot 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 like neon barbie pink and they are so cute and you guys the shoes that they have on their website at times are literally dollars like literally they will put shoes on there that are five dollars a pair and then you just have to pay like shipping or whatever but their shoe deals are awesome and I have never had a bad experience with their shoes coming broken or breaking quickly or wearing down at a rapid rate or anything like that I've always had awesome experiences with their shoes especially their shoes have never steered me wrong other than maybe I'll get them and they'll be like a size too big or too small but that's that's normal you know that's not an issue and then the last and final pair I have worn these out once or twice so you might see some wear marks on them but they are just kind of a nudish blush color of uh, these really chunky 
kind of platforms in a way. They're not really platforms, but they're just chunky heels. Uh, not so much wedges, but they are so cute. They're very easy to walk in because this back heel is so thick and chunky. And I just love these. I did have to puncture an additional hole right here so that it would be tight enough to go around my ankle because I got some small ankles, but uh, overall, yeah, the only negative thing I would say about some of their shoes is they are kind of slippery on the bottom at first, but the more you wear them, you know, the more dirt you pick up underneath and the more abrasive it becomes. So over time, they're easier to walk in, of course, but I feel that way with, with any shoe. The more you break it in, the more you wear it, the easier it becomes and the more natural it feels to wear it. But overall with these again they're kind of like the suede -y material but the bottom was really 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 slippery at first um so you just want to be cautious as far as that goes but that's really the only negative thing i can say about their shoes is sometimes they don't come with a lot of grippage on the bottom but as long as you're careful you won't break your face all right now moving on to the clothes so there were a couple items in here that didn't quite fit me um so rip i'm gonna have to try and find a new home for some of them the first being oh my goodness i'm so sad i'm so sad these i got in a small but they will not go up past my thunder thighs so unfortunately i cannot wear these but they are adorable. I'll probably end up putting these on my Depop or my Poshmark or something, or maybe possibly even just donating them, but they are adorable light pink high-waisted shorts. They have like the three buttons, and they are like the ripped at the bottom, kind of um, destroyed denim look and stuff, and they are so cute. I just wish I would have gotten a medium instead of a small. So that's really sad because these are so perfect for summertime, but hopefully maybe you guys can get your hands on these or I'll put them up for sale somewhere or something so you can get them. But, and when I went back because I had contacted the person who I usually talk with to arrange these um, collaborations and stuff, I talked to him and I was like, uh some of these don't fit and he's like we'll just send in your new selections and we'll just kind of replace the stuff that doesn't fit you and you can give it away or gift it to a friend or donate it or whatever you want and I went to go get these in a medium but they were sold out and it made me so sad the other thing that didn't fit me of course I knew it going into it that it was not gonna fit me I am so such a weird sizes on my tops and my bottom for ordering swimsuits so when I get swimsuits that's why I like the brand adore me so much because when you order a swimsuit you can order two different sizes for your top and your bottom a lot of normal basic websites don't do that like yeah sure you can go to Walmart and buy a different size top or bottom but if you're ordering something online they usually let make you choose it as a whole size so like just a medium standard size and you get the medium top and the medium bottom and you can't really fluctuate at all so I decided to get a one piece because I had ordered a one piece one time from them and I got it and I kind of liked how it felt it was a little tight on the top but it was tolerable I didn't feel like I was gonna fall out anywhere or anything like that so I just decided to continue wearing it and everything and I decided to try another medium swimsuit from their site because I figured oh well the other one it was tolerable it kind of fit me me, it could work and I got this one and look how cute this is oh my gosh I love the little floral detailing and the hot pink little accents on there so cute and the back is so cute this piece kind of goes around your neck so it's kind of tight to your neck right there and then these little um, strings we'll call them kind of like hang down your back and it just looks adorable but my boobs fall out of this so bad <laughs> like they will not stay in they just keep popping out the sides and it is not a good look so unfortunately I'm gonna have to be donating this or giving it away or something because it ain't gonna fit my body well, moving on to the things that do fit we have these jeans they are kind of tight but again they're like a tolerable tight they're not like overwhelmingly suffocating me at all by any means 
these are really adorable i love the again destroyed distressed denim with little rips in it um and then it's just kind of like this pastel like pink splatter on them just kind of throughout the whole thing and these are skinny jeans but i do you know cuff the bottoms because i'm short so they are a little bit longer um not high-waisted they're just kind of basic but yeah they just look like so they're nice i don't have any complaints they're actually really 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 good quality um and these were size usa 27 so that gives you an idea kind of of what size i am i'm usually a size three in jeans i think a 28 would have been better but i think you order it like small medium large on ami club where i don't think they had like standard sizes with those pants now these on the other hand are kind of too big so i should have ordered them a size down because they are so stretchy look at how cool these are okay so these are a size medium which i should have gotten a small in these i should have gotten a medium in the shorts but a small in the pants because these are so stretchy it just goes to show you that all brands and all styles are different so always try things on if you're buying stuff at a store because you don't know you really don't know until you get it and you can feel the fabric and see how crazy stretchy it is i'm gonna have to shrink these because they are pretty long and very stretchy but again kind of just like a slight little rip detail throughout the legs and they're just like a peachy nude color they're kind of more pinky tinted than they're coming off on camera but they're definitely more of a peachish pink um but yeah these ones are nice they're like skinny jeans i love how stretchy they are because they're going to be so comfortable i just wish i would have gotten a small instead of a medium okay nextly next up i'm just gonna grab in my bag of tricks here oh my gosh this dress okay this one compliments my body really well i like it um it is a neon yellow dress and you can see the like little lacy detailing throughout the whole thing it's really pretty i got this because i thought it would compliment my pink hair and it does it looks really nice i love the fit on it because it kind of fits tight and then flares out i love that style of dresses and Oh my gosh, I am in love with it, and this little hanger strap is hanging down, but it's so cute. I love that it's got, like, a cool little strap pattern here. Like, I'm trying to do it so you can see. Oh, there we go. Okay, so here's the little keyhole on both of the sides of the straps. Very cute. And then it's got double straps on the back. So cute. I do love this one. I love how it looks and fits. And then another dress we have. I've gotten so, so, so many comments on this dress. And I love it to death. Like, this dress is beautiful. I wore this to a friend's wedding. And I posted pictures on my Instagram with my fiancé. And you guys were like, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Where'd you get that dress? Uh, this was from Aunt My Club Wear. And it's got pink and blue and purple flowers all over it i think they're more of like carnations maybe they're not roses i think maybe they're carnations but it looks like this and i think it came with a belt no maybe not i'm not sure if this one came with a belt or not but i was wearing this little white belt with it and you can get these all over the place you can get these on ebay you can probably get these off of ami club wear i'm not sure it's just like a thin just basic little belt and it does have belt loops so you can wear a belt with it um but it's so cute again i love just the fit of it and how it looks on it's so fun to wear and just the colors are so pretty all right then another dress we have oh wait this was a romper huh this was a romper um i haven't worn this yet the tag is still on it but it is very cute it is neon the photos and camera and video and all that stuff do not do this justice because it is neon pink so there's blue and yellow flowers on here and it is pink detail or pink 
pink colored and at first I thought this was reversible because the inside is like just neon pink but it's not it's just lined that way but I love this one and the belt that this one came with is adorable so it's like that same uh, neon pink but they're little beads inside this gold chain I'm gonna go ahead and try and zoom up so you can see it's coming off a way different color on camera but they're just like these hot pink beads inside the gold chain and you can strap it around the waistband or even wear it as a necklace if you wanted to whatever you want get creative but it's so cute and I haven't been able to wear this just yet but I love this romper it is adorable okay a few more items there's one more dress in here and I just wanted a black dress because I don't have a black dress like a little black dress I don't even own one of those and I had been kind of wanting one for a while now so I got in there and I looked through probably 40 pages of little black dresses and I could not decide which one I wanted because I never really wear black so I was kind of stuck I was like hmm I like this one but I like this one but I don't like that one and I don't like that one and I don't like this one because of that but I like this one because of that but then again I don't like it and I was just going back and forth and back and forth you guys and finally I was like you know what no we're just gonna get this one and we're gonna add it to my cart because I know my body type and I know what I feel looks flattering on me so I just got the one that I knew was gonna look okay or that I knew that I felt was gonna look okay because I don't want to try out new styles or anything like that at that moment because I was just sick of looking through pages for hours undecisively so I settled with this one and it does it looks perfect on it's like the perfect style it's cutesy um but it's kind of sexy because it does have the lace but it's just again that black lace and it fits very nicely up at the top and then it has the little flare out at the bottom i know it's kind of hard to see what this one looks like but there's kind of the lace detail if you can see my camera is totally freaking out but anyway very very cute I like it I love that the top is like the see-through very cute I love how it looks on I do still want a more of a sexy little black dress but that will come in due time I guess okay then the last three things on here are like my favorite things because I feel like I can get the most use out of them so I got two crappy tops the first one is go figure hot pink um, I've worn I've worn both of these crop tops before but this one is adorable it's just basic on the front but then you turn it around and the back is twisted so it looks like a little bow with this hole in the back and it's just so cute I love how this one looks on and it matches so many of my skirts that I have very 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 cute and then the other one again looks kind of basic in the front but it has the cute lace detailing on the sleeves as well as the back so it's kind of a little peekaboo fun time on the back because it's all lacy and florally and cute but again it's kind of just like a basic crop top from the front so I don't know I love it it looks so good again with so many of the high-waisted skirts that I have and it's great it's just a plus great and then the very last item I had to have these as soon as I saw them uh, yeah I yeah. Mm -hmm. if they wouldn't have it sent me these items to unbox and review and talk about for you guys I would have just bought these and I would have not regretted it one little bit because I have a light pink velvet dress that I got from them I think it was in my last day my club or haul or the one before that but it was so cute and they came out with these high-waisted velvet shorts and they're the light pink the exact same fabric as the dress that I love so much and I had to have these hands down I had to have them and they are so cute I got these in a small I believe I believe yes a small um but oh my gosh I would have 30 pairs of these if it were possible because they are so cute and so comfortable and I am obsessed they are 
perfect. Oh, I can't get over them. I think they still have them on their site too. They've had them on there for quite a while, which I was very surprised about because usually they sell out with a lot of their items really quick, but I think they still have these on there. So definitely go check it out. If I can find the links to these things and <laughs> these products, these clothing pieces, I will put them in the uh, little description box below. But if I can't find them for whatever reason, just get on and search. Like if you're looking for this dress, just search like floral dress or something like that or like yellow dress or just search kind of things that relate to the given certain products and you should be able to find them. They have a patrillion different products on there though. Like you'll be stuck looking on there for hours upon hours upon days upon weeks if you let yourself. So don't get caught up in it. But uh yeah all their stuff is really cute and like I said they have pretty good quality um considering like their prices and they always have like crazy amazing deals of like 50% off and things like that. So I, I feel like it's definitely worth it and like I said I've purchased from them one of many times before and I have never been let down other than this little hat. Other than this hat I have had no problems. Anyway, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. I hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully the next time it will be a try on haul. Thumbs up the video if you want a try on haul next time and I will make sure it happens regardless what I get. But I did do a little mini try on haul of the stuff that I got from a different website on my Snapchat. So if you're not following me on Snapchat, you should follow me on Snapchat because I will do occasional little try on hauls or like if I get a new product or something I usually post it there first because it's the quickest it's the easiest it's right then and there it's kind of live in a sense even though it's not live but it's kind of like just immediate right then and there so follow me on snapchat manda.3409 I'm gonna let you guys go because I've been talking too much and this haul was insanely long so yeah until next time so long stay strong stay true and pu. you All right bye